Greetings, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Kaiju Wars. This fight was suggested by Camry Staples, so shout out to him. He wanted Shin Godzilla to go against Kong from the 2021 movie, which is coming out in a week. So excited to see that, shall we? Anyways, let's just get into their, you know, backstories. So, Shin Godzilla is a hybrid mutation of nuclear waste after the Fukushima disaster. He's a giant, you know, Godzilla, but instead of your regular old Godzilla that you know and love today, he adapts to everything and he looks ugly as hell. Even uglier than me. Okay, now King Kong. Now we're using Kong for 2021, so yeah. So back in 2017, in the Kong Skull Island movie, he was around 104 feet tall and weighed around 158 tons. Okay, pretty big for a huge ape. But then in 2021, oh shit, he grew. He had a growth spurt. Puberty hit him hard. He's growing a beard already in those like 40, 50 years. And now Kong. Here he is today. Giant simple monkey still, but he's a lot smarter, wiser, and yeah. Anyways, let's just get into their statistics. Shin Godzilla, well, he's 300... 389 feet tall is around 1,092 feet long. Yeah, because he's that long because of his tail. And he weighs around 101,000 tons. Pretty, pretty, he's a pretty big, chunky boy. King Kong, on the other hand, well, he's 337 feet tall. Okay, okay. And he weighs around 50,000 tons. Well, that's just an estimate. Considering his massive ass growth spur, he might as well be that big. <coughs> okay, let's fight Shouty. No, let's get into their weapons. Now, Shin Godzilla, besides biting, clawing, stomping, tail slapping, he can also shoot lasers from his tail and back dorsal plates and his mouth. But before he can shoot lasers, he has to breathe out this cloud of smoke, ignite it with flames, and then there goes his pink lasers. But he can only use it for a short amount of time before the energy runs out, he just goes completely black. Yeah, that's it. He can also swim, too. And his back and his weaknesses is his back. Everything else is just hard armor. Now Kong. Kong can bite, headbutt, punch, kick. Yeah, pretty much. Well, he also has his battle axe, which, if, you know, combined with Godzilla's nuclear energy, he can swing that shit around like a tomahawk and slam it onto Godzilla, causing a huge radioactive shockwave. You know, kind of like an EMP. Now, how would they defeat each other? Well, Shin Godzilla just has to spam his atomic breath button directly towards Kong, and Kong is just burnt monkey. But but Kong can defeat Shin Godzilla. He he's he's going to be smart enough and aim for the you know back and cause God, Shin Godzilla to bleed a whole hell of a bunch. Okay, fight. This fight takes place on Skull Island. Let's get into it. <coughs> Shin Godzilla. A group of sailors are are. The fight starts off with a group of sailors. The sailors have been stranded for days, and there's only three people left. But then they see an island, but they have a strange vibe around it. They have to get through so many damn storms and everything. And then that's when they see Kong coming out of this cave with his giant axe, looking around the horizon. He came out to drink some water. Yeah, but then out of nowhere... They all, they all hold on to the boat, and they see the giant known as Godzilla. <laughs> Kong looks up. He's fought Godzilla before, but then, so he raises up his battle axe. And roars back at the giant red abomination of nature. <laughs> then they charge. Godzilla makes his way towards the shore, but but Kong gets, jumps up 
in the air with his battle axe in his hand and slams down onto the skull of Godzilla. This impact causes Godzilla to go into the water. But the water is pretty, you know, shallow for the giant monster's size. So Godzilla just gets back up and slashes King Kong's titties. King Kong punches Godzilla in the face. But Godzilla bites into his shoulder and pins him down. Kong, Kong is like panicking so he grabs a rock and smashes it into the eye of godzilla godzilla roars in pain as the rocks are getting to his eye but then shin godzilla stands up and stomps on the chest of you know kong kong is like trying to escape he's splashing water everywhere but then he grabs but then he feels around and sees you know his battle axe so he slams into the neck of godzilla and godzilla just roars in pain as you know he falls back down onto his side <laughs> kong then gets back up clear shakes clear cleans himself and then, you know, he grabs his battle axe and then slams it into the side, into the back of Godzilla. Blood splurts everywhere as Godzilla roars yet again in pain. Blood is spilling the water and the sailors are just like getting washed away. Two of them have already died, and the last remaining sailor decides to kill himself with a flintlock pistol, and poof, he doesn't have to live with the pain of knowing that two giant fucking monsters are right right there in their journey. <coughs> Kong Kong then realizes, oh shit, his his weak place his weak place is the back. So he starts reeling his atomic his giant axe in and slams it down again. Godzilla roars in pain once more. <laughs> But then this time, Godzilla tail whips him, tail whips Kong, and Kong goes flying into the edge of a rock. <laughs> he he breaks his shoulder, but he snaps it back into place. But then he sees Godzilla opening his mouth. He knows this is atomic breath time, but wait, smoke. Kong is confused. He's freaking confused, like as smoke is coming out of his mouth. And then fire. <sighs> Kong's weakness is fire, and he gets shot at by the fire, and Kong is like rolling in the water. And then pink, pink lasers. <laughs> Kong gets, you know, he, he starts bleeding. Then he starts running away. But then he realizes, oh shit, I can just suck this up. So if his battle axe, he sucks it all up. Shin Godzilla is just like... Like, you know, he's just shooting at Kong. But Kong charges it up. But realizes it's turning pink. His, his battle axe blade is turning pink. So that's when he realizes, oh shit, um, um, what do I do? So, he knows what he does, he does, as one Shin Godzilla runs out of juice in him, Kong jumps up and slams it down onto Godzilla, but Godzilla and Kong go explode, you know. Kong gets fired back from the recoil and Godzilla, you know, getting hit, falls back down. The smoke clears. We can see that Godzilla get, gets back up and looks around for Kong. Kong is injured. And then they both charge again. Kong swings his battle axe, but Godzilla catches it with his jaws and then breaks it in half. Kong looks at this whole ha hand-me-down that his family has had for thousands of years. Now just shattered in two. Made from the femur of a g other giant monster. <coughs> Kong looks angrily with rage in his eyes, and then he punches Godzilla in the face, and then bites into his throat. Shin Godzilla is feeling pain, yeah, and then roars in pain. And then Shin Godzilla scratches Kong's nipples again, and this time chokes him with his tiny arms, and then slams him down to the ground. Kong is, you know, like, dazed. And that's when Shin Godzilla stops on Kong. Kong can't move. And that's when Shin Godzilla loads up his laser ref and... It's over. 
Shin Godzilla roars in victory. The winner is Shin Godzilla as he walks to the ocean surface to rest once again. Rick. In a fight between Shin Godzilla and Kong, Shin Godzilla would win most of the time. It would be a really close fight though, because once Kong realizes that the back place, you know, is Shin is Shin Godzilla weak spot, he's gonna aim for that place even more. But Shin Godzilla's gonna catch on to the pattern because he come on, he's not that smart, but he's not that dumb either. So yeah. Shin Godzilla's gonna catch up into the pattern and eventually, you know, adapt. And then eventually just kill him. So yeah, but anyway, Shin Godzilla wins in my opinion. Let me know who do you think would have won this fight. Bye bye.